Cajun Navy was started by neighbors being neighbors, trying to help each other out, doing search and rescue missions in their personal boats, trying to be there in a disaster situation and be some kind of help for the people there in their community. After I got out of the military, I decided that I wanted to help people as much as I could. I was a firefighter for several years. I also worked for a federal search and rescue group. We do everything from search and rescue missions. We also try to help with long-term recovery. After the disaster is over, uh, there's a lot more to be done. Knowing what's going on with the weather is the most integral part of our job. We're trying to save people's lives, and to do that, we need to know what the weather's doing at all times. We need to have updates by the second, if possible. We need to know the situation before it happens. When we're out on deployments. We use several weather apps. One that I use is Weatherbug. I have the app on my phone. When we're out doing the rescues, we're usually out in the open. We're in metal boats. Lightning's not a good thing. We try to stay as far away as we can. One of Weatherbug's features is spark lightning. It lets me know where the lightning's at, how close it is to me. It has real-time updates every 30 seconds. I can plan ahead, and I can take what safety measures I need to. Weatherbug Spark detects lightning strikes in real time across over 160 countries. Last year, Weatherbug sent billions of lightning notifications to users, leveraging its superior alerting technology. That's why millions of people trust Weatherbug's exclusive Spark Lightning feature. When we rescue someone, it's the worst day they've ever had in their life, and they know that they now have a chance, and that maybe you were their last hope. To be able to be that for someone else, it's a blessing to me.